When you run for Congress, every three months, you have to file a finance report. It shows who gave you money and how you spent it. It's all public record, so everybody can see it. You can go to fec.gov right now and see my finance report. Last quarter, my first quarter running, I raised $63,000 from people. Richard Hudson, the incumbent, raised $79,000 from people. That's not bad. He's a sitting congressman, and I'm not. But here's the difference. Richard Hudson raised an additional $260,000 from not people. That's right. 75% of his money came from big corporate interests, not people. They can have names like the American Bankers Association, Duke Energy, Halliburton Company, and Time Warner. You get it. They're powerful interests, and they fund his campaign. They don't want anything to change in Washington. They have their voices heard, and they get their bills passed. When legislation comes before Congress, who do you think Richard Hudson's going to listen to? The people who gave him $25 or the corporate interests who gave him $2,500? That's what's wrong with the system. They fund his campaign, and you get left out. I'm Thomas Mills. I'm running for Congress, and I approve this message because everybody should know who owns a piece of Richard Hudson.